In recall, we have two normal patterns of breathing, vesicular and bronchial, and this is how you're going to differentiate them. For vesicular, it has longer inspiration period and shorter expiration, VE for shorter expiration, and VESI for longer inspiration. It also has reduced breath sounds, vesicular reduced. Now let's have a listen. Now for bronchial sounds, inspiration and expiration are both equal. So bronchial, both equal. They're also louder. Bronchial, louder. Let's have a listen. Now for our added sounds, we're going to start off with rails, aka crackles. And remember that rails affects the tails. Okay, it's like crumply paper sound. Let's have a listen. Next is bronchi, and know that these affect the bronchi. This is like a rumbly sound. Let's have a listen. For wheeze, think whistle. It's a musical sound. Let's have a listen. Finally, for strider, think squeaky door in the attic, commonly due to an upper airway obstruction. Let's have a listen. There you have it. Two types of crackles, fine and coarse. These are intermittent and brief sounds. Fine sounds like when you move your fingers through your hair and coarse is like opening Velcro. This happens when inhaled air meets deflated alveoli or secretions. Let's listen. Wheezing, key word here is musical. It's a continuous sound produced by narrowed airways. Think wheezing, whistle like a musical. Let's listen. Now, Strider has a similar sound to wheezing and is continuous, but usually occurs due to a blockage of airflow in the trachea, like an obstruction. Let's listen. Ronchi, think of a rhino, they make low-pitched, deep sounds. This one is continuous too, but often clears with coughing. Let's listen. And lastly, we have diminished breath sounds, just like the name suggests. Let's listen to normal and then diminished. 